Hello, I'm Svetlin Nako from Soft Unique Global. This is my next episode from the Dev Concept Series. Today, I will explain what QA, quality assurance, is in the software industry. I'll talk about manual and automated testing, code reviews, bug trackers, and the role of the software quality assurance engineers, the so-called QA engineers. The software quality assurance is an important activity in software development, which is performed by the QA engineers. QA engineers test the software, its functionality, usability, security, and other quality aspects, and they report and track bugs and track the development process and its quality over the entire life cycle of the software project development. The most important activity in QA engineering is software testing, which is checking whether the software behaves as expected, whether it has bugs or it works correctly, etc. Testing can be manual, which means filling forms and interacting with the software by hand, and automated, which means running programs or scripts or functions which check whether the software works as, expect as expected. Okay, let's explain briefly all these concepts now. Software quality assurance, QA, is an important topic in software development. What is a software quality assurance, QA? Software quality assurance provides methodologies, practices and tools for ensuring the quality of the software products and systems and the development process. Software quality assurance goes beyond the quality of the software. It also includes the quality of the process used to develop, test and release the software. The software quality assurance is performed by QA engineers. QA engineers test the software its functionality, usability, security, and other aspects, report and track bugs, and track the development process and its quality. In the heart of the QA process is software testing. Software testing is the process of checking whether the software conforms to the requirements and works as expected. Software testing aims to find bugs or defects in the software and report them for fixing. Software testing can be manual or automated. Manual testing is done by hand using the keyboard and the mouse. The QA engineer clicks the software UI, fills and submits forms, interacts with the software UI, or invokes backend operations by hand or by specialized tools, executes certain functionality, validates that it works correctly, and tries to find defects. Manual testing also involves testing the user experience, UX, the user interface, and the visual look and feel of the software. It also focuses on testing the UI and the behavior in different environments, web browsers and hardware devices, as well as checking security and other aspects. Automated testing is done by scripts and programs which perform robotic checks of the software. Instead of clicking the UI controls, filling and submitting forms by hand, QA automation engineers record scripts and write programs to, do auto, to automate this and to check whether the software behaves correctly without human intervention. Thus, QA automation experts are software development engineers in test. In addition to testing, there are few other approaches in software quality assurance. Code reviews and quality inspections are proactive approaches to software quality. 
They aim to catch defects and bad practices early before they appear in the functionality. Such practices are typically done by senior developers or senior QA engineers. Code reviews aim to enforce good practices for internal code quality, such as writing understandable and maintainable code, avoiding repeating code, using clear abstractions, formatting the code correctly, naming identifiers correctly, structuring the code in a clear way, and many others. Quality inspections try to find problems in the code by understanding the program logic and internal design. The goal of the testing process is to find and report bugs uh, or defects and issues with the software. Reported bugs are described, submitted and tracked in a issue tracking software. Or simply bug tracker. In the issue tracker, developers and QA engineers discuss the issues, prioritize them, assign them to team members, track the word on the issues and the changes of their status, confirm when an issue is fixed and finally close it. Issue trackers uh, track not only the defects, but also new features. feature requests and other issues with the software. Software quality assurance is a broad top topic in software engineering and is a separate profession in many software companies. QA engineers should have basic software development and technical skills, skills and strong attention to the details and quality to be diligent and patient and to work persistently on the software quality, testing and test automation. As an example of QA engineering work, let's look at a sample issue tracker. The above link opens the public issue tracker of the Bootstrap project, which is a popular responsive design framework. Let's see what's inside. We have uh, a few hundreds of open unfinished bugs and a few thousands of closed or completed bugs issues in the github uh, in the github issue tracker issues have title descriptions labels and commands Some issues can have also assigned developer uh, attachments, projects and milestone, but let's focus on the concepts of issue tracking. not on technical details. Let's view what's inside an open issue. This is the description that begins with a description of the problem and then commands follow. Closed issues are similar but they are either fixed or refuse to be fixed for some reason.
Did you like this lesson? Do you want more? Join the Werner's community at softunit.org. Subscribe to my YouTube channel to get more free video tutorials on coding, dev concepts and software development. Get access to more free dev lessons and learning resources for developers. Get help from mentors and meet other learners. And it's all free. So join now softuni.org. Also check out my other videos from the Dev Concept series where I explain and demonstrate many concepts and technologies from the software development profession. Type in the comments below what topics you would like to see next. Goodbye, see you in my next video.